Asante sana. Asante. All right. <laughs> uh, this is Power Talk. A very good morning to you. Thanks so much for being part of today's morning conversation. My name is Ram Maguko and a warm welcome to you. As you've seen today, I have a fantastic, fantastic program lined up for you in, on this particular segment. Remember, we are coming to you live from the Broadcasting House here in Nairobi, Kenya. We are also live on our website. That is at www.kbc.co.ke forward slash y254. Clark. The band is in the building, in the building. Now, I shall to Patea Muziki Kidogo, fantastic guests that I have lined up for you. Ensure that you tell us what you think about this particular music. It's all about music and lifestyle. We shall talk about different things, different aspects in regards to their music, their journey, the challenges that they have faced right here on Power Talk to keep you motivated and inspired and informed and what not. And it's Juni Kombi and Nini. Today, you don't want to miss today's morning conversation. All right. So, ensure that you engage with us. The hashtag is one in the morning. Uh, the hashtag is Power talk that's like his power talk show on twitter at ram maguko and at y254 channel lady and gentlemen thank you so much for coming thank you. uh let me start with uh, you um so next to me uh of course i shall introduce each each and every one of them um so here we have uh habil uh next to me he is uh, the uh the group uh, c ceo <laughs> <laughs> Is a group. Uh, is called. Is from Empire Gig, the founder and CTO of uh, Empire. Habil Onyango. Can you say Habil? Asante. You're well. Thank you for having me. All right. And uh, next to him, I am with uh, uh, Rick. He's the, the guitarist, uh, playing uh, the chords right there. Nili jaru kuguza guitar kidogo nikao na kumbi sio sio mdo mochango. Rick, thanks so much for coming. And uh, next to Rick, I am with uh, Clark. Clark King. Yes, yes. A musician, Karim yeah. Clark, uh, and uh, next to to Clark, uh, I'm also with uh, Zawadi. Powerful name, <laughs> the only lady in the group, <laughs> uh, the only one. Uh, seems like you're the engine <laughs> of the group. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, to, 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 to 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 my extreme right, I'm with Ivan Thomas. Karim <laughs> Sana. Or do we say Ivan? Mali. <laughs> the last one. <laughs> the, the, the last one. All right. So, um, Habil, let me start with you. This team. How did you guys start? 
Fantastic, fantastic. I think I will be very brusque and tell you in front of you today, these guys are fantastic. They are creatives, and what you've just seen is the tip of an iceberg of what they can really do. Mm -hmm. So in the story of Origins, I will be very clear to introduce, I am Habil from Empire Gig, and Empire Gig is a platform that has brought together creatives alike, the likes of Clark the Band, Mali, Zawadi, Clark, and Rico, all creatives under Empire Gig. Mm -hmm. which you can book, you can have what you just witnessed on the studio mm -hmm. in your living room mm -hmm. through Empire. In your living room? Mm -hmm. In your living room. Mm -hmm. you, want you, yes. you, you do like in-house events also? Yes, yes. I mean, if you we want, do. Yeah. Wow. You can have the smallest the events huh. with the biggest of concerts. Are hey, you saying? Session in the shower. <laughs> yeah, we can perform. <laughs> 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 uh, okay. so, uh, so how did you guys like meet up? You know, how, uh, how, how, did, how did you meet? Okay, um, that is a that is a good question. Um, so I it think it was yeah, pretty much. Gold. What? Pretty much. Ah. Uh, we do an event called Gold. Mm -hmm. uh, so we started. Um, we knew each other before the event. It started this year. Ah. But what happened was um, we were working more as individuals and as groups. I was working with her. I occasionally work with him. Occasionally they'd work together. Mm -hmm, and then mm -hmm. we decided, uh, okay, there's this one event coming up, it's called Gold. We actually have it next Saturday. Mm -hmm. And we decided, yeah, let's try this event out. So we went out, so if I'm singing, they're behind me. If she's singing, we're behind her and so on and so forth. Ah. And then we met uh, Rick. And then we're like, you know what, we can do this. We can do this in the time. So you, you guys met Rick at this event? This event, yeah. Fantastic uh, uh, music here. Yeah. Yeah, Fanta you, you. I, I love how he plays the Nini. <laughs> I, I thought it was an acoustic guitar, and then I'm hearing some different sound. I'm like, I'm like wow. So it's, so it's custom made? Mm. Huh? Yes. Custom made? Yes. Wow, wow. <laughs> um, so, I, I, Ivan, yes. um, so how is it working with this, with this team here? This team, it is, to be brief, fluid, which as an artist is... It can be hard to come by, especially as upcoming artists. You're trying, you have all of these different images in your head, these different sounds. You're like, I want to execute it in this way, to this caliber. Uh -huh. It needs to be magical. It needs to carry the yeah, audience yeah, on yeah. on their feet. I want them to cry. I want them to laugh. <laughs> Any, but when you are unable, when you are unable to get to that, it can be very of putting your day mm -hmm. into ruin, mm -hmm. but you're like, I just know I could have done it no, differently. Yeah. So in all my years mm -hmm. doing music, Finding all of these lovely people, it has been fluid. Fluid. L life just flows. <laughs> it's, 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 it's a free flow. It it's flows. Flows. Yeah. It's flows. I couldn't stress. I couldn't stress. Yeah. Tell me about Empire Gig. What is it all about? Ah, fantastic. So Empire Gig in itself is a global platform uh -huh. that puts together all creatives of all genres. We do, like the people in front of you, musicians, mm. uh, painting artists, tattoo and makeup artists, voiceover artists. Wow. All the creatives that need an opportunity mm -hmm. for work. We call them gigs, where I'm from. Mm -hmm. A mm -hmm. gig is a short-term <laughs> engagement where mm -hmm. you come in, you express your art, and you get paid for it. Long story short, come up with a gig and in your empire gig. No one be. gig. That's the word. That's the word. <laughs> so hashtag, hashtag gig. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So yeah, it's, it's, it's a platform that gives opportunities, uh, legally and, uh, and financially qualified opportunities to mm -hmm. creatives, professional creatives like the ones you see before you. Wow. So wow. you can just go in and that's what I meant by if you like what you see here, mm -hmm. the same demonstration of music they've mm -hmm. done, mm -hmm. and you have a small event, it could be a wedding, a concert, it could be something bigger. Just yeah. go to Empire Gig, book all of them, mm -hmm. and they will deliver. How can people find you? They can find us at Empire Gig everywhere, mm -hmm. and of course, EmpireGig.com. EmpireGig.com. That's mm -hmm. You have your own website, man. Mm -hmm. Man, this this crew, this crew. <laughs> Why did I find you a long time ago? <laughs> you huh? found us now. It's chance. It's chance. <laughs> I found us now. Uh, yes. I want us to touch uh, um, a bit about uh, your music, and uh, uh, I want us. I want you to give me a number, but. Uh, I, uh, um, as uh, as we prepare for that particular song, I want you to tell me yeah. um, how it was bringing them all together in one room, yeah. because I'm seeing different characters here, mm -hmm. uh, different <laughs> different di different types of uh, energy, mm -hmm. you know, all summed up yeah. fluidly. <laughs> <laughs> 
We have a great understanding. <laughs> <laughs> uh, how was it? Uh, I mean, um, like he said, uh, yeah. it was an uh, opportunity. Uh, it was happening at the Blues in Nairobi. Um, and I met him mm. first. I met uh, him oh, oh, who, Mali. Mm -hmm. Ivan Mali. Uh -huh. uh, he was doing a live gig at the time. Um, and a friend of ours, the owner of Blues, is called Matthias. Mm. I hosted them for the day. Mm. And I just sat in and listened and I felt the music that they were playing really spoke to me mm -hmm. as an individual mm -hmm. and I wanted to see more of that. Mm -hmm. I wanted more people to experience what I had that day. And he told me, you can. And, and there's another band he works with that would really love an opportunity to express themselves more. Mm -hmm. So I said, yeah, I jumped at the opportunity. I would love to see you guys play live again. And he said, come to the next one. So I did. You told him, come and... Yeah. And I saw, I got to meet uh, Clark next. Mm -hmm. and Zawadi after and since then we've been working with them in a series of gigs wow. at different wow. other locations All right. and we've been experiencing the same magic and we want to share it with you and everyone at home thank you so much I mean, thank you so much sure. and thanks for honoring me to come here man <laughs> thank you it's a pleasure let's get to the music sure. okay no problem no. um so Clark yes what, what are you going to perform for us today what am I going to sing uh, yeah. this song is a song I released last week on Friday Last week. Last week on Friday. So it's on YouTube, it's mm -hmm. on Spotify, on Apple Music. If you want to put it on Instagram or Snapchat, on Twitter, Every on, on, on TikTok. It's everywhere. It's mm -hmm. everywhere. Let's make it trend. Uh, yeah, let's make it trend. Uh, the song is called Heaven. Hashtag Heaven. Heaven. It's called Heaven. It's called Heaven. Is it, is it a gospel song or something? I guess we'll find out. <laughs> okay. Uh, Ladies and gentlemen, Clark, the band. <laughs> See, it doesn't care if you run running Cause truthfully you can't have running And I know the battle is daunting But you cannot win it by running And bull by its horns as they call it a head-on collision is coming So make sure your armor is ready Cause hell and confusion is coming Now I don't know where you came from What you want and what you're here for But for you I'm not fearful The sun's turning black as I'm watching The stars up in heaven are falling The rivers of warm wood are forming Rains from the clouds are pouring And children are waiting to nourish Farmers are waiting to harvest And businessmen waiting to profit has arrived here to turn it. See, now I don't know where you came from, what you want and what you hear for. But for you, I'm not feeling.
is mine. <laughs> that it is. That it is. <laughs> man, these guys are giving me goosebumps, man. Appreciate I have, you. I, how would you um, classify your kind of music? My kind of music? That's a difficult question. Um, honestly, it's a difficult question. I've tried classifying my music. Yeah. Uh, the best answer I'd give you is uh, I sing what sounds good to me. That's yeah. honestly it. If I were to play you six of my songs, they're huh. different. It's not like purely this or purely that. Yeah. It's just, it sounds good to me. I'm going to sing it to everyone, mm -hmm. and they're going to like it. Mm -hmm. Yeah. <laughs> I, I love this. This, this, this song, um, I don't know uh, if I watch too much movies, <laughs> but I was in my picture uh, when, you, when you sing, Heaven is mine, and I, I'm looking at this scene in this movie, and um, see, uh, uh, maybe it's an uh, if it's an action movie. Yeah, you know, that's yeah. What they are. And yeah. then he's walking in slow motion, and then he's, he's jumping and shooting everybody. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> you get what I'm saying? Yeah. So, so like, uh, and then the Apunopali, the main character, is being shot. Kabisa. And then you think he's going to die, but, but actually. He, Flips it. it flips it. <laughs> and he had the Bible. <laughs> <laughs> so it stopped the bullet. Yeah, he had the Bible. I had a Bible. Yes. Stop the bullet. Uh, and then he, 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 he falls he down. And then, the uh, that's, the, that's when you have a shot of the hand falling on the ground. Kabisa. Heaven is mine. <laughs> Uh, that would, uh, we in, should petition in, this in, for a in movie. Film producer who's listening. <laughs> yeah. This is a soundtrack right here. This is a soundtrack to you. Yeah. You guys have just given her the script. Now <laughs> just putting it's just, it. It's about time. <laughs> That's all that remains. That's all that remains. So, so you composed the song. I composed the song. Yes. Ah, yeah. uh, it's a beautiful. It was a beautiful thing. I was watching. Uh, I was watching a movie ironically. Uh, but not the same kind. <laughs> so after the movie, um, you know how you. This happens to a lot of us. You watch a movie and you get so drawn and in, soaked into the movie, mm. you kind of forget that it's, it's not real. It, it, it affects you personally. Yeah, like the anxiety, yeah. the, 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 the drama just gets to you. So I watched this one episode. I was like, Ay, yeah, well, what is the point of life? Uh -huh. So I went, I went to my room. I sat there. I was this close to crying. So it, it's a movie that moved you? <clears throat> it moved me terribly. So ironically, I can't remember the movie. This was two years ago. Uh. But I remember how I felt. I felt terrible. I was like, this cannot be it. This cannot, this is terrible. How can this happen to anyone? Even if it's not really happened to anyone. But like, so I went and sat down. I took, a, took my piano, started playing around, and then I wrote this. And then as time went by, I wrote the chants around it, and then I recorded it, uh, produced it, and I put it out there. So, you know, it, yeah, should, it should find its way to a movie. That would be... <laughs> we, we, we all love different things that can can move us to create, a, you know, write songs. That is true. And, and 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 sometimes it can be that that movie you watched, and then it reminds you of something, mm. and then you just be, be, be begin to you know write down those lyrics. Yeah, and then and then you come up with heaven is mine. <laughs> Completely. <laughs> Completely. Man, these guys uh, are creative. Um, uh, uh, Ivan. Yeah. Um, uh, there's a name you call him. Yeah. What is that name? Ma. Mali. Mali. Yeah. You did tell me Mali. You told me Ivan. <laughs> <laughs> Why are you running away from Mali? I'm not running away from Mali. I'll never run away from Mali. Reminds me of... Why am I talking about myself in the third person? <laughs> <laughs> yes. Um, uh, we are still individual artists, all of us, as much as we collaborate with each other often. So um, Mali is my last name, and it is what I refer to. Myself as on stage. Oh, I am, okay. I am so, 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 so you you still perform individually? Yeah. Yes. Yeah. yeah. Even, even though you come together occasionally, yes. You still do individual, individual performances. performances yeah. Yes. Okay. Um, uh, Mali. Yes. Um, coming to you, I'm I'm looking at the the your part in the song. You you're doing that. Um, how do I call it? Chant. Huh? Chant. Yeah. Chant. Mm. You're, you're doing that chant, and 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 you know, if you were able to get him, you could see those facial expressions, <laughs> especially from Zawadi. Mm. <laughs> from, from Zawadi, um, Mali. The experience you're getting from uh, working with a team like this, I'm sure there are those times that you you, you sometimes get into arguments and fights. You know, <laughs> often, <laughs> often, every day. How is it working with this group? Wonderful. <laughs> um, I am fortunate enough to work with a lot of people that are not only wise but educated in what they do. So as much as we ha can argue, it's a very healthy argument. It's, wait, friend, friend. As much as you are approaching it this way, 
I just want to reinforce you on your journey. Do you, do you, do you mm. ever argue about the lyrics? How should the words come in play? Where do we put this word? Where do we put that word? At times, yes. At times, yes. Because um, we are singers, we are also songwriters. And one of our key goals is to communicate. Mm -hmm. So if you say something and I feel, hey, I feel like if you said this, the message would hit home better. Mm -hmm. It would hit heaven. Heaven is my home. Oh. Hashtag heaven is oh. my home. <laughs> uh, but we do criticize each other's works. We put it through, uh, I almost want to say, what's the cement roller? Uh, cement roller, it's called a cement roller. Yeah. You put the idea in the cement roller, you let it be beat around, beat around, beat around. If it comes out the other end, okay. It's a solid well, song. Yeah. But at the same time, we're individuals and we know, hey, if I know in my heart, hey, this song is... Yeah, it's, it's good. It's, 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 it's good. good. Doesn't matter what anybody else might tell you, but we listen to each other often. So, sounds more religious in a way. Yeah, actually, <laughs> yeah, it could be. <laughs> Is it? Yeah. It, it has a religious too. Yeah. Because <laughs> I, I, I'm looking at how someone saying heaven is mine, heaven is a home. Mm. You know that's what well, some people yeah, that's say. What I'm talking if about. you go to a funeral, they would say, you know, they, that would apply. Yeah. And even the song in itself, if you look at the lyrics. Um, I, I am a very religious person, um, so it's not hard for me to tap into that. Mm -hmm. Every once in a while you'll hear a reference to God or a reference to something in the Bible. It's just it's one of those things that just comes to me without even trying. Mm -hmm. When yes, this is one of those things because me, me, I find comfort in heaven existing. So mm -hmm. I, I, I want you to, to, to pick this microphone. Let's hear the voice of this guitarist ah. here. <laughs> <laughs> So um, uh, you, 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 you've been playing music for them, you know, how, um, how, how, what are the challenges that I, I, do you get, you know, trying to uh, tune in? Because I know all of them, based on what I hear, they have different voices, different vocals. Mm -hmm. Hass is, is a bit higher. Mm -hmm. Ivan's is slow. I, yes. I could hear some bass. I don't know if he has bass or something. Yes. Yeah, it was him. Quiet. Why? Well, actually, it's been lovely because they're as professional as they come. Thoroughly, mm. they know their craft and they're taking it seriously, which is more than you can ask for musicians. Mm. 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 So, ah, in regard, no, it's been it's been fun. Even not just easy. It's it's fun. It's mm. enjoyable. It's enjoyable. Mm. It's enjoyable. And, and, and um, l l let me get it from, from you. When it comes to um, pulling the band together, mm -hmm. because at some point there has to be those instruments that you, 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 you bring on board, mm -hmm. you know, um, do, you, do you have an extension of uh, others that you're working with that, of course, you bring on board to help to uh, nourish and improve and nurture the, the, ta the talent you're working with? Yes, to a certain extent. Mm -hmm. uh, there, there are a lot of people. It's it's very resource heavy, so you need people mm -hmm. and you need equipment. So you have to make a lot of friends. Either that, or you spend a lot of money. So, <laughs> <laughs> so yeah, it's uh, mm -hmm. in fact actually the the Empire gig solves that for. Yeah. It may connect me to other artists within theirs, within anybody. So mm -hmm. you know, it's we're all moving in faith. So you know, we help each other where we can. All right. Yeah. Yeah. I, I want us to go to Zawadi. Zawadi. Umenyamaza sasa. Sasa nitaongea. <laughs> <laughs> now you feel the tension is gone, no? <laughs> <laughs> the only lady in the group. Allah. Huh? Hmm. Do they at some point try to prove themselves uh, uh, with their ego? <laughs> How can they? I can't allow them to. <laughs> they cannot. You cannot? No, they don't. But they don't. Uh, How does it feel being the only lady in the, in, in the team? Honestly, uh. it's amazing because they're not only like people I work with, they're also very close friends. So mm -hmm. outside music, there's like a whole family here. So it's, mm. it's amazing. It's actually an honor working with you people. Never said this, hear it now. <laughs> <laughs> we must cry on national television. <laughs> <laughs> I love your vocals. Um, what do you normally do to, 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 to you know, uh, train? Oh, a lot. Like, ah. lip rolls. <laughs> <laughs> um, there's a whole, like... Noise. Yeah, <laughs> a noise. Lot of noise. All of you 
Yeah. Now, do that. It's, this is uh, for a vocalist. Mm. This is the equivalent of doing push-ups to someone who walks out. Yeah. Mm. So you just have to be the loudest person in any neighborhood. Just in the middle of the night, just mm. screaming, shouting. It's how you train these guys. Uh, um, for, for the lovers of music outside there, and they want to know a few vocal training tips. Um, but let me give the three of you now. Mm. Give us a few vocal training tips that uh, those who are, are interested in music, mm. those who are singers, and uh, the, of course they sing in different uh, uh, platforms. Yeah, yeah. Um, you know, what do they, should they do to have a healthy voice? A healthy voice. Um, As it's open for, for the three of you. Okay. Now, there's exercise, there's your diet. Uh. Those two. Let's start with those two. Mm. So if we start with your diet, for example, um, honey is golden. Honey is honey is good. Honey mm. is everything. Expensive. You don't want to have. Uh, don't say that sugar. it's too much sugar. No, actually no. It's healthy sugar. It's healthy sugar. Ah. So if you're having any kind of sugar, it should be that one. Depending on how deeply into it you want to go, you want to monitor what kind of foods you're eating. You don't want to have too many fried foods or too many nutty foods. Uh, certain days you don't want to have. Um, Citrus, citrus, citrus dries the throat, they say. Whereas uh -huh. milk uh -huh. uh, coats it more. It uh, produces a lot of mucus in your throat. So you want to be very picky with what you so have. So avoid, so you should avoid milk? On a, on a more general scale, uh -huh. yeah, on a more general scale. Uh, okay. It's very mucosal, and so mm. having a lot of mucus for you, uh, it's, it's not the greatest. Mm. You have uh -huh. to do this all the time. <clears throat> It's mm. not a, but yeah. definitely a lot of water. A, a lot, lot of water. And not the, not, the, not the day of the show. Not the day of the, the show. Day of the your day life. Before. Your yeah. life. You Consistent. wake up, you sleep, you're minding your own business, water. Mm. Water. And then pretty water. much just eat healthy. Uh. Yeah. And then, uh, the so technically, eating healthy has an effect on your voice. Yeah. Mm. It really does. Uh -huh. mm. then, um, in terms of exercise. Uh. Got, like physical exercise or just mm. vocal, vocal exercise because physical mm. exercises like um i think running for example mm. helps with your breathing and breathing as an artist is i mean it's everything it's pretty mm. much everything you yeah. don't have to run out of air mid phrase yeah mm. so i'm going heaven is my home <laughs> <laughs> you don't want to last there was a, there was a day so I, I saw someone sing let me pick that one. Heaven is my home. Send yeah. yeah. Um, give, give, uh, how, how does it go? Heaven? Um, heaven is my, my home. All right, Sasa, let me say my home. Send it. Uh -huh. so, okay. <laughs> so, <laughs> there's this guy, there's uh -huh. this guy who, 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 sang, who, sang, who sang it like, like, like this. Lily Checker. <laughs> <laughs> I love till I saw, I had to sit down. <laughs> My whole oh, oh. <laughs> no, that, that yeah, that what happened. No, breath, breath, maybe an accumulation of saliva, mucus. Hey, no. all of them. <laughs> oh my whole. <clears throat> Oh, oh yeah. that is <laughs> now that one. That one you have to spit. Listen, as a vocalist, sometimes yeah. you throw your pride away. You uh, spit. No no, 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 no. Listen, listen. Me, I'm telling you. I'm telling you. I've watched. Um, there's this musical called Hamilton. Uh, this one guy, he starts singing, and he's he's really in character. He's playing the king. So he's he's you be back. And as he's talking, spit is accumulating in his mouth. But it's it's um it's it's me it's a musical, so he really has to like enunciate. His mouth has to be open. So he had a choice: swallow the saliva and compromise on the quality of how you open your mouth, or just stop caring. If you watch that thing, he just spat. Like he was like, listen, you choose, you choose. I will keep my dignity. <laughs> <laughs> it's going to rain. <laughs> I, I mean, rain. you bought a VIP. You get to taste some of me. <laughs> no front row seats. Asha, VIP ticket. A VIP, V VIP. The whole experience. So, what would you say? What would you say is the problem with uh, someone who sings? Who has a problem with you know singing like that? They can't sustain. They can't uh, you know hit those high pitches. Yes, that that is exactly it. Um, depending on the day, there's count a countless number of reasons as to why your voice is the way it is that day. You might have woken up at the right time, eaten the right things. Maybe you're a bit sick. Or maybe you try to have just a little bit of this thinking that, okay, three hours to the show, I'll have digested, blah, 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 I'll be fine. Mm. But for whatever reason that day, it's just not there. Mm. <sighs> and you? Your advice? Well, I think they should just 
practice more because uh. the more you get used to your voice the more mm. easier it is for you to use it so uh -huh. yeah that's true yeah. Before we went on air, I, I heard you and, uh, and saw you do something. Me, 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 me. Oh, uh, <laughs> okay. Um, <clears throat> that just helps to open your voice. So things like brrr, lip seals, uh. Uh, it helps, like that, for example, helps with uh, where the sound comes out in your mouth. So people should do brrr, a lot, loudly. Yeah. With a falsetto. Yes. Brrr. From down, down there up. all the way up there. So from your, from your subharmonics up to your falsettos and your mm. flageolets, all the way up there. Mm. All right. I, I, I want to talk to Abil now, <laughs> and then, and, and then, as, as you prepare a song, no um, you, you, you'll give us the next song. Now, right. um, I'm looking at the, their training. You know, um, how how is it that uh, they do the training? You know, for 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 a team like this, and uh, how do you ensure that there is quality, and there is unity, okay. there is uh, and there is that harmony that is there within the team? And because I've seen so many groups. So many teams come together, but at some point they they stop doing what they're doing, and and, and the question is, what is it that they were doing before that they are not doing now that is affecting them during training? Mm. Yeah. Uh, fantastic. That's a really good question, and I think to open it up a bit more, I will start with one of the things that we saw was a gap in the market mm -hmm. way before then. It's a problem that affects us as let me call ourselves normal people. Mm -hmm. We are creative <laughs> in other ways. We can't sing, but we are creative in other ways. Yeah. And then there's the creatives. It's the issue of trust. Um, when Zawadi said it first, they are friends. That was the first thing that brought them together. They were friends mm -hmm. before, and they are friends on stage. And when they are singing, they are working together. Yeah. So that's work and friendship. There's a proper balance between work and life. Uh, relationship for them. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. So the trust that they have in each other as friends allows them the privilege to sit down and, like Mali was saying, listen to each other. Yeah. You have an idea of how this um, uh, song should go, right? Mm. And you're putting it into the mixer. And Clark is your friend, so he understands where you're coming from. So that builds that unity and, and trust. It's like, if Mali said it and Zawadi agrees, then probably they are right. I could be wrong. And then when you take up uh, what they've put out, you know, and it mm. comes out great, it resonates. And you say, oh, okay, so indeed, okay. this is true. Yeah, yeah. So uh, the friendship aspect and the yeah. trust aspect is very key to creatives working together. Mm -hmm. And this is how you see the most successful bands, boy bands, even going out. Uh, mm. The ones who are friends and stick by each other mm. are still together to date. The guys yeah. who... They have some, some bond. They have mm. a bond that's closer than family. So, so would you advise this team that is watching you today, yeah. a band that is watching you today, to uh, start building a bond together so that they can... If, if a problem arises, then they will have already solved it through the bond that they already, already have. I would. In fact, in the creative gig economy, which is where we all are, I think... Problems will arise. Not if they will. They will. It's mm. Almost guaranteed. Mm. You know. So if you have something to fall back on, you have the friendship, the unity, the trust, the creative art. Because everyone on stage today is a professional in their own right. You guys trust each other. All of them. Hundred percent. Yeah. So when you have that, even when you're facing bad times, because they experience, the creatives experience a lot of problems, uh, from promoters to uh, food. Mm. Mm. Mm -hmm. What do you mean food? Oh, ah, 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 I'll, I'll tell you more. You know, all these things put together. Anyone who's ever put up an event in their whole life will tell you there are 1.2 million moving pieces, you know, and mm. you have to make sure that everything goes right so that the sound gets to the person just right mm. so that it touches, it motivates you, it gives, it paints a picture, just like you were telling us you had the song and you had this solution where you pictured a movie in your head and mm. the whole script unraveled. Yeah. Mm -hmm. For it to be that level of precision, a lot of things behind the scenes need mm. to align. Mm. So much so from the unity to the resources they have to the rehearsals they mm -hmm. do. And that is where Psychic has mm -hmm. perfectly positioned itself. Mm -hmm. The backline. Wow. So that whatever we bring into the front is spectacular. So, so, so guys, if you have a team at home this, th these are lessons you can be able to pick from, from, from Empire Gig, yeah. from this team here, uh, Akina Clark Harvey. Yeah. You know, these are tips that you can be able to, to, to pick up that will help you to have a strong team 
yeah. a strong working team <coughs> that uh, uh, that can stand the test of time. Yes. Yeah. Right? Yes. Yeah. Um, uh, um, do we get another song? Um, you have something else to say? I, I have a lot of things to yeah. say. Uh, I would say um, I am a startup founder, so when I get a platform, I will use it. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> we still have time. time. We still have time. We still have time. Uh, I think uh, definitely moving on to another blessed song would be a better approach. Okay. Yeah. And then after that, we will talk about finances, funding. Ooh. We love that. Mm, like it. We love it. You love that. <laughs> Absolutely. Because that's where people, people mess up. People get into problems. And that's mm. where people disagree also. <laughs> that's where people disagree. Mm. And that's where people give up. That's true. Mm. Yeah. Okay, si lazima. Si lazima. Because when the flu fluidity. Hey, when the fluidity goes like this. Friction. Friction. Ah. <laughs> Velocity may change. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so, a uh, clap? Ah, no problem. What do you have for us now? Uh, I'm going to do um, something I arranged together with their help. It's an acapella. It's two different songs. Uh, yes, let's just do it. All right. <laughs> so. <laughs> okay, so. <laughs> three, two, one. Hallelujah, 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 Given up on love, I'm lost and found. I find myself in a sea. I don't even look to the sky. I don't wanna cry when I say it's been lost. I walk up on my eyes that I. Can't analyze and I given up on la 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 strangers acting like they would die for each other. My oh my that is why I've given up on la I don't wanna cry when I say it's been lies that will Hop on my eyes that I can't analyze you. I've been thinking about me falling. And it's cause of you. Maybe bright colors would make me feel the smile on my face that will never go blue. Will never go blue. Will never go blue. Now, smile on my face that will never go blue. So I don't let go. But. But. That's all I've <laughs> and do, do you know what you've reminded me of? Mm -hmm. uh, what is this called? And if I ever fall. Uh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I love that song. Uh, uh, you, you know that song? Uh, not enough to sing it. But <laughs> <laughs> uh, and if I ever fall again. I will be sure that the lady is a friend. Yes, that, that, that one, that one. <laughs> there is a way it can, it can mix with this one. Yeah, that's, that's a, <laughs> next time we'll do it. Huh? And remind, we'll do it and mention Same you. Time <laughs> Same time next week. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I think the power of, of what they've just done, yeah. Capella, is, 
is uh, like Zawadi and, and Mali were playing with their voices the entire time, and then the lyrics fell to one person, mm. and they still blended. Those are three people yeah. working with the same goal. So yeah. music is just teamwork put together, you know, and, and the way they put it and deliver it, it's quality work. It's really cool. Mm. I mean, mm. Now for me to want to book them, right? Yeah. Amen. Yeah. 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 Book, yeah. book, book, book. Please book us. We're here. We're book ready. Them. The creatives <laughs> are here. Right now. Yeah. I, I, and you know, I um, uh, it was interesting seeing how they started. Yeah. Mm. And uh, they were like, um, which note are you hitting? Mm. Which note are you hitting? Okay, mm. I will hit this, you hit that. I, I could see those non-verbal communication. Yeah. <laughs> uh, that happens all the time. That's about, it, it, happens. it needs to happen. It needs to happen. Uh, have you ever come across a time when um, you like went off key? Went off key? Not with this group. Uh, <laughs> us, us, we're pretty good. Uh, <laughs> but, but yeah, it, I think it has happened a couple of times. But I think part of being a good vocalist and a good musician in general is being able to hear that you are wrong. everybody else no. and yourself wow. and realizing, wow. ah, this is a mistake. I can fix it. So you make it, uh, you make it like a run. So I go, ah, and then I find myself, and then somewhere, everyone's like, that was somewhere. beautiful. I'm like, you don't know, that was a mistake. <laughs> <laughs> All right, I want to take a short break. Ah, no okay. problem. And then we'll be back. Uh, after we're back, we are going to be touching on a few things uh, 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 that we have not yet uh, touched on. Mm -hmm. Also hearing more of their music and uh, how they have been uh, going so far in terms of finances. What about funding? How are they doing? Relationships. Ah. Allah. How? Allah. It's a, it's a Thursday morning. It's, it's a, a, a Thursday morning. <laughs> what is this? <laughs> the hashtag is, one, the, the hashtag is Power Talk Show on Twitter uh, at Rambagukot, the white for channel is where you can be able to find us. Engage with us. Tell us where you're watching us from and what you think about Clark and this particular music that we are experiencing on Power Talk. Let's take a break. We'll be back in a bit. This is Power Talk. Y254 Imagine Rain on me, rain on my 
my future. Rain on me. And I pray. Rain on my future. Rain on me. Rain on my future. And I pray. Rain on my future. Rain on me. Rain on me. Wow. That is uh, Clark, the band. Rain on me. Ah, warm up. <laughs> <laughs> Welcome back. Thank you so much for being part of today's morning conversation right on Power Talk. It is all about music and lifestyle. I'm with Clark and the band today. Uh, we are talking about music and lifestyle. Do you like their music? By the way, send in your requests, P.I. You also sing requests? Uh, I mean, yeah. Yes. It's yeah? Too it's too many. All right. <laughs> I can knock something else. <laughs> Um, I, I, I ensure that you engage with us. That's like it's one in the morning. Uh, that's like it's power talk show. You know, by a cool one, I'll be willing. Unaita moja mingine jina ingine. This is even on la lunge. This is not why this is power talk. That's like it's power talk show at Ram Maguko and at Y254 channel is where you can be able to find us. Engage with us, tell us where you're watching us from, and we shall sample your feedback as we continue with today's morning conversation. And uh, Clark, um, who, who was I talking with? Uh, yeah, Habil. Yes. Um, when it comes to funding, mm. how do you? How, how do you get funds? How do you cater for your expenses in terms of, uh, you know, what you're getting out there and what you're also getting in? The yeah. income, the outcome, how do you balance? Checks and balances. Ah, fantastic. That's really an amazing question. And I will, of course, use what I have done and learned from these amazing people in front of me and hopefully portray it in a way that will be okay. So funding is a challenge. That's the underlying let me just start from the facts. It's a challenge, especially for up-and-coming creatives. Uh, you'd find um, to get money, you have to do value. You have to create value. Mm. Like they would sing, and that's value. It brings you peace, a feeling of joy. That's value. And that's what you're trying to, you, you, yeah. you need to create. That's what you need to create. And, and the reward system is money, funding. You're, you're given, thank you for your time, thank you for your talent. And a creative is empowered because he's, he's done something and he's been paid. Yeah. And he's going home happy and he's empowered to do it again mm -hmm. at another time. But you find that has not been the case, especially in the music scene. Mm -hmm. The creatives <coughs> put a lot in it. They go to school. Mm -hmm. They rehearse. Mm -hmm. They put all of this together. Mm -hmm. And then they bring it on stage to perform. Yeah. And then you find that the creative has given it their all mm -hmm. completely. Mm -hmm. And still, the funding doesn't come. Excuses follow. You see, you're told, this is not coming because of Y. This is not coming because of Z. You know? And the creative has no option but to understand. But inside, he's demoralized because he's put so much into it and it's not showing. Is, is this one reason why we don't see much uh, okay i don't know I, I i don't know if it is it is it is what is on the ground there you you can tell us why some creatives give up and some now choose just sing whatever thing that is there because if anything uh, there is no value for money and uh, whatever they are giving in is not what they're receiving back so they will be like ah let me just do it for the sake of just doing it you know, for the sake of just ensuring that at least I've released something. Mm -hmm. So there is no content, mm -hmm. there is no quality, and someone says, ah, see, after all, after after all, all I'm a Exactly, it's like they're doing it for themselves. Uh -huh. It's not even for you anymore, because uh -huh. that's a very powerful article and an answer to that question. Yes, that is one of the main reasons, because this person is not empowered. He's not uh -huh. feeling motivated to do it. And, and, and that is one of the biggest issues that the creatives have been facing. Uh, they will attest to this. But, the, but, but then how do you encourage each other when there is lack of funding? And, we, and how, how do you keep going, man? I think um, I'm going to do a vertical very well into Empire Cake. And this is a problem that we are facing. It's a real time. Mm. A lot of creatives, the ones on stage and the ones at home, are experiencing it. And we don't have a magic bullet that will solve this problem. But we have the first step. Mm. And what we've done at Empire Gig is ensure that all the creatives who come in, all the creatives who bring us their talent, they share their copyright with us. They, all that talent they're going to put out in gigs, in other experiences that they will give us, we put them in 
a qualified, both legally and financially qualified opportunity. Mm. We'll tell Clark the band or Mali, Ivan and Zawadi, okay, fine. This is what we'd want to give you. This is what we are prepared to give you in form of money or remuneration, funding, you would call it. Mm. And this is what we'd want in exchange for your time. Mm -hmm. And this contract will, in exchange, help properly protect the interest of the creative and properly protect your interests mm -hmm. to make sure that they give quality work like they promised and you also meet your end of the body. So, 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 so guys watching from home, they need to support creatives. They do. 100%. They do. They are, but they're not doing as much as they should. Um, I will not put the blame on anyone right now. What huh? I would say is I would rather they support creatives, not by shout outs and posting them. That's great. That's really good. Uh, we, we are not saying no to that. Let that continue. But let's look at the bottom line. There are a lot of bills to be paid by the creatives from rehearsals to transport to food. A lot of every small pieces that go into it. So mm. when you pay a creative, you're helping them do what they do best. Mm -hmm. So let's keep the spirit. Let's share, mm. but also let's not harden our hearts to pay. Let me hear it from you guys. So what is about this is your funding? Pesa, funding. Kuposa, pesa. Yeah. I think I think for me, uh, funding is mostly, a, it's, it's not even a financial problem. I think it's a cultural pro problem. Okay. I think as a culture, we don't, we understand we like music, but we don't see, we don't understand that for music to be as good as it is, it needs funding. For anything pretty much to be as good as it is, it mm. needs funding. Mm. So think about equipment. It's very expensive. So those who have a lot of money will buy very expensive equipment and then charge you to come use that equipment, money you don't have. Mm. Or you'll find radio play, airplay is mostly really good quality stuff. I can't take that away from them, but from first world countries and places where they fund their music. Here on the other hand, uh, nobody wants to pay for something like boom play. Nobody wants to, to, to pay you for your music. They want to get it for free. They want to pirate it somewhere. Uh, nobody wants to come to your show if it's 500 bob because that's apparently too much. You know, mm. No one wants to give you money, but they want you somehow to produce good quality. And then also at the back of their minds, it's been a, a thing I think all of us can attest to. Mm. Being a musician is it's not, it's not an easy job. It's not a fool's job. It's a difficult job that requires you to be actually really good. Mm. And the, 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 the effort it takes to be half as good is not appreciated. Uh, no one, very few people come up to you and you're like, oh, I'm a musician, and they take you seriously. They assume for some reason you're not doing well in life. And so you've picked a career. <laughs> they they, they like, feel like musicians are... Uh, are people of, you, yeah, you people who dropped out. Dropped out. Yeah. And you so this is a yeah, fallback. Yeah. School dropout. Yeah. Yeah. And you see, yeah. once they already do you like that, yeah. asking them to fund <laughs> you is, is, is not something you can do. You can't talk to someone who already looks down on you and tell them, give me money for what? The, you know? the, then how do you fight this kind of uh, stereotype? How do you fight the stereotype? Huh? I think us, for us now, and as people like Habil who are trying to help the creatives, we the creatives, what we try and do is, we are going to just be in your face about this. Yeah. We're going to, we're, we're trying, we're working as hard as we can to prove that you're wrong, yeah, you you're wrong. We yeah. are great. We're actually really so good at what we do. Y you try to prove that? Yeah. In a way, yes. You wake up every day, you do your exercises, you do your rehearsals, you do everything you can. Almost <laughs> hoping for a chance to show this person, like, you just, just come to the one show. I just need you to come to the one show mm. when you come to that one show you'll see for yourself mm. without a shadow of a doubt like wait wow this has been going on for the whole year mm. the, like no this and, is and like I, there's been so many times when somebody will approach you and they're like no you don't understand this uh, is nairobi this is within kenya you're telling me somebody like you all of you guys you're here in nairobi you've just been here yeah where have you been i'm like here the whole time. <laughs> He's been here the whole time, every weekend. <laughs> I live in the same neighborhood. <laughs> <laughs> they, 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 they just don't see you. They just don't. That's they another don't. thing. Uh, they don't Vision. see you. They don't see you. Mm -hmm. Not in a bad way. In a, again, we aren't able to support ourselves to the extent that other people, we assume, are able to support themselves in different countries around the world. Being seen as an artist is huge which is why a lot of people enjoy i think spotify as a platform because if you manage to get yourself through the right channels you will be seen and once you are seen the likelihood of you improving yourself improving your craft improving things in general all around 
Skyrocket. What about, uh, I'm trying to compare mm. singing as a group and singing as an individual. Which one works best? Which one, which one sounds better? Which one sells better? Because I've seen many groups say that, hey, you know what? Um, well, we have been working together for this period of time, and it's time we part ways. And while there are others who are saying that we have been working uh, separately, um, can we do something together? Form, a, form uh, some form of band yeah, yeah. or some, some movement that will revolutionize the music industry. And then different individuals come together and then come up with a particular label. Ah, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. What, what do you think about that? What do I say about that? Um, I think to be, uh, I think the art industry as an industry, we need to be, to, that's when we need to agree, we need to be to united. I can't push the, this agenda alone. All of us like this, the mm. five of us, the six of us rather, we're not enough to push this agenda. All the collective artists, uh, be they bands or individuals, can work together to make the gig industry and the art industry successful. However, we are called differently. And so that would mean uh, somebody like Tupac, he began in a group. But clearly, at least from what I've perceived, he was meant more to be alone than to be in the group in he was group. in. Yeah? Yeah. However, uh, look at the band Queen. Mm -hmm. uh, Fred Mercury did better when he was together with the group mm -hmm. than when he was alone. Not to mm -hmm. say he was less talented. Mm -hmm. We are called differently. So to say that, you know, for example, have the band is doing well, mm -hmm. doesn't mean that every group that Can is in threes will do... Some people are just meant to be... You, you're Michael Jackson, you're yourself. Mm -hmm. You're yeah. alone. Yeah. And some are meant to be, let's be two, mm -hmm. let's be three. I think it takes more a self-awareness mm -hmm. to do best. Because it would be so sad that you're talented and you're working alone, yet you're supposed to be five. Uh -huh. You know what? Do, would you go solo? Well, I oh. would, but no, I I feel like the more we are in this, the more ideas we even have to put on the table, the better my music will be when we're together. Uh -huh, uh -huh. Yeah. And, 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 and I'm looking at uh, teams that have managed, because yes, what, what you said is true. There's some people who really perform well when they're individual. Mm -hmm. But okay, if they do collabs, <laughs> Kidogo Shida. Kidogo Shida. You guys, you, you, you produced a song, mm. uh, Man Solo, and it was so good. But if you do a collab, most of your collabs don't they actually don't turn do out well. well. Yeah. It means they're better off alone. alone. Yeah. Mm. While others are better off, better off singing people, in, yeah. in, in, in teams. Mm. Yeah, let, let me hear what Habil has to say about this. But before that, uh, and after that, we're going to get a song. Um, prepare something for us no as problem. we uh, as as we continue. Cindy, no all right. Sure, sure. Uh -huh. uh, together or apart. Well, mm. someone said I can't remember who. Uh, united we stand, divided we, we fall. fall. Right? Iron Man. Uh, Iron Man. Iron Man. <laughs> no, I'm joking. No. <laughs> <laughs> Man, I'm like, oh, what? The? I, mean, I watched what the, the movie yesterday. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I did it. It's, it's okay. Um, so I think uh, I speak on this in, in two ways. Uh, one, let's say uh, Michael Jackson, for example. Let me use the late uh, Michael Jackson as an example. Mm. He was an amazing performer. He inspired a lot of people across the world. And he touched so many lives, right? Mm. But alone as Michael Jackson, like if it was just one person, there was not so much he would have achieved. Because behind the scenes, there was a bigger team a bigger team of publicists, a bigger team of social media managers in that time, quote mm, unquote. Mm. Uh, a bigger team of people he used to throw ideas at and bring them back to him. So as much as someone might step out on stage alone, I don't believe any creative is ever truly yeah, alone. Yeah. Yeah. Mm. That, that mm. whole creative space yeah. helps them, mm. guide them and build them up. But in the performing, in the delivery, some people are just talented. They're called for it, just like mm. Clark said. Mm. They're called to deliver it perfectly to you. Most mm -hmm. people won't see what goes down behind it, and that is the industry. What, what is your thought in regards to those who get manipulated and uh, misled and conned in this uh, industry of, of, of creatives? And you, I would see, I've seen producers, you know, uh, 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 lie to uh, upcoming artists that, oh, no, we are going to do this, we're going to, we, we promise you this. They promise heaven and deliver hell. Uh, that's <laughs> true, uh, that's true. And I think the biggest problem causing that. Um, and this is, again, I, I might be said I'm walking the line. I'm trying to be very politically correct. So I will not put blame on anyone. But what I will say is the one thing we need to fix that is trust. Mm. Because if a creative is being told, come do X and we'll give you Y, 
right? The promoter, the producer, is also depending on Z and A so that he can be able to meet his obligations. And we've seen a lot of promoters get a very bad rap, and sometimes rightly so, right? Because they were depending on X and Y to be able to meet their obligations. But so, that doesn't happen. So what should we do? What we should do is we should be very honest in, in what we can do and when we can do it. Mm -hmm. If a creative says, I would want Y to be able to accomplish this. And mm -hmm. me as a promoter, I know depth in my heart, I cannot be able to do that. Okay. Okay. I can be very upfront and honest and say, this is what I have on the table. If we could work together on this, mm -hmm. I'm sure you'd be able to get your audience and perform. Okay. And I would also be able to provide this much in support of that. Mm -hmm. and, and we can only do this through enhancing trust in the whole industry because it's mm -hmm. a whole of a lot of pieces coming. It's a bunch of people. Yeah. It's yeah. a bunch of people. If I, could, if I could add something. Sure, sure. Yeah. It wouldn't hurt the artists themselves yeah. to learn more about the business behind their craft as well. Fantastic. Because, yes, you should definitely trust somebody, but you should also go into it with an amount of awareness as to what is going to happen to you, what might happen. It might not guarantee anything for you, but you know, okay, yeah. I know at the very least, this is how, mm. let's at, say, at, a contract at, works. Mm. Know something. Yeah, yeah know, know something. Don't be dumb. Yes. Pretty much, pretty much. Good, yeah. Great summary. Yeah. <laughs> 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 uh, I, I'm, I'm, I'm told time is not on our side. Oh, wow. <laughs> so um, we need to, 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 to wrap it up. That's and um, I want to you t I want to ask a final question, mm -hmm. and of course uh, uh, f f we, we can all feel free to have a final word, mm -hmm. and then we'll sing a last song. Okay. But now my final question is: um, How can people get a hold of you? Ah, fantastic! That's the best question we've been waiting for all day. Um, <laughs> <laughs> uh, so you can find us at Empire Gig everywhere. That's Facebook. Like and share and subscribe. Uh, Instagram, you can follow us. Facebook as well and empiregeek.com, which is where we'd like to send everyone. Uh, everyone in studio today and everyone at home are watching. Uh, if you have an event, if you want to book a creative, if you want to sell creative things, Empiregeek is there for you. <laughs> and we have all the solutions, all the videos you can watch. And if you want the creatives you've seen here on your own sitting room, on your own platform, you can wedding them together mm. or you mm. can book them individually uh, depending on who enticed you more you know mm -hmm. and you can do that also on the platform so mm -hmm. it's uh, a global thing and we hope to be moving out taking these creatives outside the country at some point yeah and bringing yeah. more here so powerful. it's powerful, powerful. thank you thank you so much, thank you so much. guys uh can you jump as you wrap it up we're good stream my music Oh. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Say it again. Stream my music. Clark King, Clark King on Instagram. No, this is about the song. So Spotify, Apple Music, everywhere, YouTube, Clark King Heaven. All right. Yes. All right. Thank you guys. So, to go out. Yes. Yeah. So you can give us a, a, a final you, song. The last song. All right. All right. All right. And before that, let me just wrap mm -hmm. it up, and then uh, you will, you, you're the ones who are going to take us uh, through that particular need. Uh, do they sing fast or do I wrap it up? All right. That's out. All right, so, uh, so uh, uh, t t take us through. Give us a song.
Alright. Uh, 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 nataka tumalize sasa. Alafu ndo tuende. Ndo tuende. <laughs> and uh, I've been told that we just wrap it up there and I want to end with that quote. This is this is what I was waiting for. Music is what tells us that the human race is greater than we realize. Tell us, do you agree with that? We do. Huh? We do. It's a huh? powerful word. That's that one. That's, 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 <laughs> that brings us to the end of Power Talk show, uh, show today. Uh, remember to tune in again tonight. We have a repeat of this show at 10 p.m. My name is Ram Maguko, and this is Power Talk. Thank you so much, Clark the Band. So All right? Much. Give us a song. To <laughs> Kianalea, Sasa. And then you have Nibambi. Like the legend of the Phoenix. All ends with beginning. Yeah. Ah. But what keeps the planet spinning? The force from the beginning. Ah. Cause we come so far. I'm up all night for good fun. We're up all night to get lucky. She's up all night to the sun. Woo! I'm up all night for good fun.